This is a fairly typical maths Olympiad question where they try and make the maths look as complicated as possible. But in actual fact, if you follow um, the three power rules on the right, which are well known, a, b to the power of m equals a to the m, b to the m, a to the power of m to the n equals a to the m, n, and the inverse, which is actually exactly the same, a to the m, n equals a to the m to the power of n, but which is one that, that people tend to forget sometimes, um, this question can actually be resolved relatively easily. So let's take each um, uh, of the expressions um, one at a time. So root 8 to the power of root 2. Well, root 8 can be written as 2 root 2, so that's 2 root 2 to the power of root 2. And then by uh, power rule 1, a, b to the m is a to the m, b to the m, that is 2 to the root 2 times root 2 to the root 2. Okay, so let's just leave that for the moment. Root 2 to the power of root 8, which is the second one, let's see what that is. Um, well, we know again that root 8 is uh, 2 root 2, so we can rewrite that as root 2 to the 2 root 2. And then by power rule uh, 3, this one, um, that is equal to root 2 to the power of 2 to the power of root 2. Uh, and root 2 squared here is just 2. So that equals 2 to the power of root 2. Now we'll leave this third uh, expression for the minute. Let, we'll do that later. So anyway, we have, um, let's just uh, rewrite what we have. So we have uh, the top expression is, 2 to the power of root 2 times root 2 to the power of root 2 over 2 to the power of root 2 and we can now bring the other one down which is minus the square root of 2 to the power of root 2 with everything underneath the square root. Okay, now these two cancel. That's nice and easy. So we are left with root 2 to the power of root 2 minus the square root of 2 to the power of root 2. All right, now let's just have a look at this, this expression here. Root 2 to the power of root 2. Okay, so another way of writing that is 2 to the power of root 2. Oops, sorry, excuse me. Is 2 to the power of root 2 to the half, which is basically just the square root. By definition, the square root of something is to the power of a half. And then by using our power rule uh, number uh, three, that, uh, sorry, power rule number two, that is equal to two to the power of root two times a half, which obviously is the same as two to the half to the root two, just flipping them around. And then by using power rule three here, we have that equals um, root two to the power of a half to the power of root two, and two to the power of a half is just the square root of 2, which is the square root of 2 to the square root of 2. So in actual fact, um, let's have a look. Root 2 to the root 2, where the root 2 is underneath the root, is exactly the same as root 2 to the power of root 2. So we can now replace this or whole expression here with root 2 to the power of root 2 minus root 2 to the power of root 2, because this we just proved is the same thing as root 2 to the power of root 2, which equals 0.